All right, thank you for that. Bar patrons jumping into action at a bar right here in Florida as well. Yeah, they took down a gunman. That whole thing was caught on camera. Local 10's Alexis Frazier is in the newsroom to show us. Yeah, the Flagler County Sheriff's Office says the suspect had a moment of rage and started shooting at people over something as simple as not being able to find his car keys. Put your hands high in the air right now. Right now, high in the air so I can see them. Do not reach down. Do you understand me? Flagler County Sheriff's deputies say they found Connor Anderson in a parking lot not far from Smiles nightclub in Bonnell. Do not put your hands down for any reason. Let me make that very clear. The Palm Coast man was arrested after investigators say he fired a gun inside Smiles nightclub on Palm Harbor Village just after midnight Sunday. Somebody let dispatch know he says he's got the run gun underneath his right side. Witnesses say Anderson had been at the bar with a female customer when he became upset about being unable to find his car keys. Witnesses say he left the bar, then came back with a gun, put the female in a headlock, and held the gun to her head. Other customers rushed over and tried to disarm Anderson, whom detectives say fired six times towards several other patrons. You can see debris flying in the bar's security camera. Hands straight out, just keep them out. You understand me? Deputies say Connor Anderson was still armed with a 9mm Glock handgun when he was taken into custody without incident. Yeah, you know what I got to tell you. I got, I got a pocket knife in my I, right I pocket. See, I see it. Don't no worry about it, bud. I got it. I, 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 I got it. I got it right here. No worries. And here is another look at Anderson's arrest in a parking lot not far from that bar where the shots were fired. And here's another look at Connor Anderson, who is facing charges of shooting deadly missiles, aggravated assault, and several more. He is being held on a $542,000 bond. Incredibly, though, no one was seriously injured in that shooting. The sheriff says the bystanders who intervened, well, they are all heroes. Janice? Okay, Alexis, thank you.